Universal Credit, or UC. Universal Credit is an employment benefit. This means the job centre has decided you are able to do some type of job. When receiving Universal Credit, you need to show the job centre you are looking for employment. The job centre will keep asking you to look for work until you find a job of some type. Being asked to go to the job centre all the time can be a pain and make you worry. The best way to stop having to go to the job centre all the time is to find a job of some type, if you can. The job centre will be happy if you find a job with just the right amount of hours and they will leave you alone. Why do you need to go to the job centre to get universal credit? Universal credit is what is known as an employment benefit. This means it is a benefit you get to help you find a job. Benefit money is supposed to be used to pay the bills until you find a job. Working is the normal way people get money to pay bills. This is what most people do in their lives to get their money to pay their bills. They have a job. Work is what the job centre wants everyone who can do a job to find a job. When you have a job, the money you get from the hours you do takes over from the universal credit money because you don't need so much universal credit anymore if you have the right job with the right hours for you. You can use your wages money to pay your bills now like most people do. And this is why the job centre is involved to help you find a job. If I do too many hours at my job, will my benefits stop? No, but it will change. Universal Credit works alongside you and your job. The job centre makes sure that if your money from your job is not enough, they will add benefit money to your wages so you don't lose any money. So your benefit doesn't stop, it just changes and works with your wages. The only time it would stop is if you found a job that pays so much more money than you get from your benefits. Which, if this happened, you would be very happy for your benefits to stop because you would be rich. So, Universal Credit is there to support you while you need help and stops when you are rich. Why does it look like my benefits goes down now I have a job? Benefits are split up and sometimes we forget about the money we use to automatically pay bills like rent and other household bills. What we see is our benefit spending money. It is important to remember all the different types of benefit we get and see the total amount of money we get from benefits each month. That amount is important to know. That is the amount you need to pay bills and live on each month. At the moment, this amount of money is coming from your many different benefits, like housing benefit, council tax benefit, unemployment benefit. This is all called universal credit. It's the unemployment part of the benefit that is going down, the benefit spending money, because your wages spending money is going up. When the money you get from your job goes up, the money you get from universal credit goes down because you don't need it anymore, because you have more money coming from your job. It all balances out. What we need to do to make sense of, of it all is to add the benefit spending money with the wages spending money. With that total, we can show more clearly what is happening. When you think your benefit money has gone down, add your benefit money to your wages money and you will see the total is the same as before or a little bit more. When you have a job, you see, you can earn more money than you can get just from benefits. The more hours you do, the more you get paid. This is something else we get confused about. How many hours can we work and still get benefits? Getting more hours should be what we are aiming for because then we won't need benefits. It is much better for you to do as many hours as you are able to if you're on universal credit. The reason for this is that having a job gives you more freedom and choices and opportunities you might not normally have. This is why other people have jobs. Right, let's look at how universal credit works. I'm going to explain it in a simple way. How universal credit has been designed to, to work. 
The job center might talk to you about a threshold. When they say this, they mean the threshold is the point at which your job money has become more than your benefit money. This is a good thing. When you get a job, you stay on universal credit while you have a job. Universal credit works as a safety net while you are getting started in your job. This means if you get a job with only a few hours, your job money will not be enough to pay all your bills. Universal credit will add money to your wages so that you always have enough to pay bills and buy food. It works like a seesaw. It's like a seesaw because the benefit money and wages can go up and down. Let me show you what I mean. The blue column is all the benefit money for rent and bills that sometimes get paid automatically. The red column is the benefit spending money we can buy food and clothes with. The white column is both the red and the blue benefit monies added together. The white column is the amount of money you need to live on each month and is normally kept in the bank. Look, I'm going to put a black line around the white column to show you if there are any changes. Now, look what happens when we start a job. We add a green wages column. This is the money you earn by doing hours at your job called wages. When you get paid from your job, the green column will go up, meaning you have been paid wages from your job and you have more money in your bank. Because you have more money in your bank, you don't need so much benefit money to keep the total money you need the same in your bank each month. Now look at the red benefit money column going down. Did you notice that? The red column only goes down when the green wages money goes up. But look, the total money in the white column or the bank is not changing. The money is staying the same and sometimes the money in the bank is going up. The reason for this is that you can earn more money from a job than you can get from benefits. This is why most people want a job, because a job gives you more money than benefits. And more money means more freedom to choose what you want to do. Well, that's how universal credit is supposed to work. The good thing is that if you still need help with money, the job center will still give you some benefit money to help your wages pay the bills. Remember, it all balances out. Sometimes it might not look like you have more money, but you are better off when you get a job when receiving universal credit. It is always a good idea to share any worries you have about the money you are getting with your support person, so that person can check to see if everything is correct. Sometimes everyone makes mistakes. You can ask that person to show you all the benefits and monies you have coming in and that person can create a total amount you get each month. This will show you how much better off you are now you have a job. Sometimes it is hard to find extra hours, so don't worry if you only have a few hours. Be proud you have a job and Universal Credit will support you and your job until the right time comes along and you can get some extra hours. I hope this has been helpful. The benefit system is complicated. Each person's benefit will be a little different to yours. So don't worry if yours is different. That's normal because each person is different. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.